Time now for our Northmore Athletic Boosters MVP, and it is Jax Wenger, who tonight scored three touchdowns, or two touchdowns on the game to help the Golden Knights get a victory. Uh, Jax, congratulations. Um, first half, uh, their run game really <laughs> – Gave you some problems there. Uh, offensive, we'll, we'll get to the defense in a second, but offensively it seemed like you just had one little hiccup, a turnover on downs in the first half, but you were scoring at bay. Just what went right for the offense tonight? Yeah, I mean, Coach Hall, again, drew up great concepts for us. We knew that their secondary would bail, and uh, we just worked in practice all week on great concepts for that. Um, we had to get a mix of the run and pass game going, and we were finally able to do that in the second half, and obviously it showed. Uh, then defensively out there, uh, Great adjustment for you guys in the second half. Uh, what went wrong in the first half maybe for you defensively that you were able to adjust to and make right in the second? I mean, we just had to get more guys in the box. We went in at halftime. Coach Shears made a great adjustment to bring five linemen in, and um, it brought us back to week three at Mapleton when we were getting our butts kicked in the first half like that. So we knew we couldn't come out in the second half and let it keep happening, so we made a good adjustment and were able to fix it. How excited were you guys when coach said, "Hey, we're gonna get an on we're gonna try the onside kick the star off the second half and change momentum." Yeah, I mean it's always a good feeling when you get to do something a little different, try to get some momentum going, and it worked out really well. And how much did that change momentum? Because you get the ball right there, you immediately tie things up, and it just can't change the complexion. Uh, just how how big of a play was that, and how big of a play was your buddy Bo Landon to get right there on the perfectly kicked onside kick? Yeah, it was huge. I mean, instead of them coming out and having a long drive, we were able to get the ball quick. Our crowd had great energy from it. They were great tonight, and the momentum was just in our side the whole second half from there on. Um, you get another home game. Trimble upset Elgin, so they will be playing you guys the 12th seed here next week, but how awesome is it to be playing two home games now here on this turf with a chance to go further than no any other uh, Northmore squad's ever been able to do. Yeah, it's amazing. I mean, I don't know if Northmore's ever had two home playoff games, but it's a great you feeling. Haven't. Yeah, the I mean, the community was great tonight. The crowd was getting into it, and it's just a great feeling to be able to play here again. All right. Uh, lastly, as always, Jax, you want to look into the camera, give anybody a shout-out. Go for it, my friend. Uh, yeah, shout-out to my family watching, and shout-out to my cousin Morgan. There you have it. Uh, Jax Wenger, who will be practicing on the football field for at least one more week. That's going to be a good feeling. Thank you very much, Jax Wenger. Thank you. <laughs>